I have officially owned a Tesla Model 3 for one year. It is my one year anniversary and I thought it'd be really cool for me to share with you my top 10 favorite features. So let's go ahead and check it out. Starting off with number 10, Tesla keyless entry. There are two ways you can enter the Tesla. Option one, you can use the Tesla card to lock and unlock the doors. Alternatively, you can use the mobile app to unlock and lock the doors. Tesla also have a feature that will unlock the doors when you get close to the car. Also, when you walk 10 feet away from the car, it'll automatic lock. Number nine, Tesla minimalist sleek design. Tesla interior design follows a minimalist approach with a focus on functionality and simplicity. The dashboard is uncluttered with a large touchscreen display as a central control panel. The absence of physical buttons and knobs reduces visibility, distractions, and create a clean and streamlined cabin. As you move to the back of the car, you will notice how much space you have with the Type-C USB chargers making it easy to keep your devices charged. Also, the panoramic view is one of my favorite features of this car. It's just so nice just looking out of that glass window and just being able to take in the amazing views, especially the sunsets. So the next feature I'm going to talk about is the custom driving profile. So depending on, you can have up to 10 custom driving profiles, so if you have different family members driving your car or if y'all sharing the same car, you can set it up to have 10 different custom driving profiles, meaning the seat adjustment, the steering wheel adjustment, the climate control, all that you can configure for each driver. So right now, I'm gonna show you how to set up the custom driving profiles because each driver you can customize their profile so they'll be able to just get in the car and go. Customize a driver profile, you simply wanna click on the screen you're gonna click driver profile settings. Then you're gonna click add a driver. I'm gonna do a test driver. So I'm just gonna simply type in test. And I'm gonna click create profile. Now I can adjust the mirrors. I can go up and down on the steering wheel till I get it to my desired position. A cool thing is you also able to change the climate control. So every time you get in the car, it'll be at your desired temperature. Um, so I think that's really cool, the custom driving profiles. Number seven, Tesla technology. I think it's super cool. On the screen, you, as you can see, you can access stuff like Netflix, Hulu, all your streaming services that you would see on the TV. Also, you have like your toolbox, you have your arcade where you can play different games. Um, I know you guys like Solitary. <laughs> it's an old school game for sure. You also have the racing game, which allows you to drive this car and play the game with your stern wheel. The tires even move outside of this car. I think that is hilarious. Right here, you got your toolbox. You got a romantic mode where you can just get cozy. You have a sketch board. You can just sketch different stuff. Don't judge my handwriting. Thank you for your support. So one of the benefits of owning a Tesla is definitely the extra storage space that you have. This is the Model 3 and you still get plenty of storage. Um, you have two compartments. So in the front, you have the front. In the back, that's where you have your trunk. In both places, you can put luggage, you can put bags. So it's definitely plenty of storage. Number five, Tesla camp mode. Tesla camp mode is amazing to say the least. I recently took a trip and went camping in my Tesla and it was great. Um, you are able to control the climate control and sleep comfortable in the Tesla. Um, it puts it in a low state so it doesn't kill your battery. You still have access to all your entertainment stuff. So like Netflix, you can play games or whatever you want to do. If you want to just chill out and camp, you can do it. But definitely camp mode is worth checking out. Navigate to the nearest supercharger. Show me all the chargers near me and you can see here are the chargers near me.
So this is not really a feature, but it's a benefit of owning a Tesla, is the supercharging. Tesla has the largest supercharging network, and it helps out when you're taking road trips. You don't have that anxiety. Am I gonna have a charger? You know, where am I gonna charge? I never had that anxiety when I take road trips just because they have chargers all over the world. Another cool thing is most places offer like free Tesla charging. So like if you're at the mall or for instance, for me where I live at, they have free Tesla charging. I think it's important that if you're thinking about buying a Tesla, also start to look into what charging options you're gonna have before you purchase the car. Um, but a lot of apartment complexes do offer free charging. So you have to do your research, but I think that's another cool thing. You don't have to pay for gas. Oh snap, I almost forgot my dogs in the car. Hold up, hold up. Before y'all come for me in the comments, Tesla Model 3 has dog mode, which allows you to keep your dogs in the car at a controlled temperature so they'll be comfortable while you're running your errands and making a quick stop. But don't leave them in there too long. Number three, Tesla Sentry Mode. Tesla Sentry Mode is an intelligent vehicle security system designed to monitor and record potential threats around your parked Tesla. This feature utilizes the vehicle cameras and sensors to detect suspicious activities and notify the owners through the Tesla mobile app. You are also able to save the footage on a USB flash drive. So one of my favorite things about this car is definitely the performance. So it's no gears. So when you, woo, when you hit the gas, she just go. Seriously, um, the performance is one of my favorite features. It just get down the road when you need to go around cars. You don't have to worry about none of that. You just hit the gas, and she throw you back. She throw you back. She throw you back. Have you ever like, you know, when you like on a plane, and the plane take off and it throws you back. This Model 3 throws you back just like that plane throws you back. That's why they call it the spaceship. I'm gonna hit it for y'all one time. One time, I'm gonna hit it. I'm gonna hit it so she can throw me back. I tell you, the speed is definitely my favorite. I love, you know, now I don't speed that much, but it's good to know when you need it, you got it. And she's there. And the autopilot is phenomenal. I'm in a tunnel right now. I'm gonna put the car on autopilot in the tunnel. So now the car is in autopilot and I have, you know, I don't have my, I don't have my hands on the wheel, but I'm watching the steering wheel and I can touch it anytime. And it'll tell you when you need to touch it, but autopilot is phenomenal in this car. Like as long as you paying attention to the road, the car will break it'll stop for you. Um, the stern, it was it will, it will take over and stare for you. Like the autopilot is phenomenal in this car. Like it slows down, it stops, but you definitely want to keep your eye on the road when you're driving. Don't just rely on the uh, the autopilot because, of course, it's still it's technology AI features. So you need to pay attention to the road. But the autopilot is definitely phenomenal in this car, and I really like it. I still have it in autopilot, and it's gonna break for me. It's gonna slow down for me. So. Definitely autopilot is something that I use frequently, especially if I want to, like, if I'm taking a long road trip and I just get tired of hitting the brakes. So like it tell me to put my hand on the steering wheel. But for the most part, autopilot is really good. But you do still need to watch the road. Like right now, I see all these cars coming. Like I'm letting autopilot do its thing, but I'm still like alert. So if I can, if I need to take over at any time, I can take over. To disengage from autopilot simply, Simply tap the stock and it'll disengage for you. So those are my favorite 10 top features of the Tesla Model 3. I'm gonna thank you guys for riding with me. Be sure to comment your favorite feature in the comments and stay tuned for the next video. Oh, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Appreciate your support. See you in another one.